beautify Carbondale hit a temporary roadblock this weekend. Members of the Pioneer City's Shade Tree Commission say someone or a group of people destroyed several trees and a flagpole on a popular walking trail. Eyewitness News reporter Eric Dable shows us the damage. It's sad. It's really, really sad that this is what our society has come down to. Bent over and snapped like a twig. Marie Lawler couldn't believe her eyes Sunday when she discovered what was done to trees along Wirtz Brothers Lane. I was very upset. I was heartbroken. We had just spent two hours the week before cleaning this all up, weed whacking it up, picking up all the garbage. Over the last decade, members of the Carbondale Shade Tree Commission, along with school groups and Boy Scouts, have turned what used to be a swampy path into a formal walking trail connecting city businesses to 7th Avenue. The group is small, they're all volunteers, and what they do is a labor of love. Everyone feels so bad because we get all kinds of good comments. While some trees were snapped completely in half, others were just hacked into. The rope on the group's flagpole was also cut, and their tree city flag tossed on the ground. Members believe whoever's responsible for this damage planned ahead, and that's because if you look at this garbage can, you can see they actually hacked into part of it on several different spots. Despite the damage, the volunteers say they will fix everything. If this is the way they um, let their anger show, I feel bad. I think they need help. In Carbondale, Eric Dable, Eyewitness News. Shade Tree Commission members believe the vandalism happened between 10 o'clock Saturday night and 4 o'clock Sunday morning. They are working with police to try and get some surveillance video from nearby businesses. Next up.